Hey guys, this is Bring Back the Farm, and today I want to show, show you guys my strawberries. And I really want to go over each stage of the strawberry plant so you guys can see with your own eyes what happens and how strawberries grow. So it's kind of cool. Let me uh, show you guys what I'm looking at. So this is a strawberry plant right here. And you can see we have some dark green leaves and we have some lighter green leaves on these strawberry plants. And we have a bunch of these things, these little rope type uh, parts of the plant called runners. And you have uh, berries and all sorts of things. But, so what happens is, is this plant, I planted it in the ground and it was just like a little, it was a little start like this, right? Like just like that. And this one, you can see the roots are starting to go inside the ground already. This is a start, a strawberry start. So you can actually take this and you can plant it anywhere you want. All you have to do is cut off the, the little rope vines and go plant it somewhere and you got more strawberries wherever you want. Or what you can do is you can let a strawberry plant just kind of take off and it will send out these runners and wherever it touches the, the earth, it'll start forming roots like that. And then it'll just kind of spread the plant. And these light green leaves are there because they're new leaves. So they're brand new baby plants. Whereas these darker ones, these darker leaves like these ones, they've been here a longer time and they're just kind of, they're just older. They're not bad, they're just older. But what happens is, is then the, the plant will start to flower. You can see there's a flower right there. And the flower will open up See, let me show you this one. This is the stage. Check that out. So that is a little flower. And that flower is about to open up, right? And once it opens up, it'll look like this one right here. And then what will happen is the bees will come and pollinate this flower. And then that flower will close back up. And then it'll start forming a strawberry. Just like that one. See how small that is? It's because it closed back up and now it's starting to reopen with the strawberry itself. And then as the strawberry plant grows, it starts to look like that. And that strawberry will continue to grow full size and then it'll start turning white. Like this one. See how that one's white? And the seeds are kind of red. It's because uh, it needs the sunlight to change and to help ripen the strawberry. But this is the next stage of the plant. It starts to look like that. And then, once, once this is full size, then the strawberry will start to change color. And let me see if I can find one here. Oh, here's one. So this one is starting to change color. You see it? It's starting to change. This strawberry will not get any bigger. It is done. And it's already starting to look good. Shoot. But then once the strawberry turns all the way red, let me see if I can find another one. There it is. There's one. And there's, the, oh, that's a better one right there. So you check this out. This strawberry is done. So it's a good shade of red. It's shiny, it's not dull. It's just the seeds are, have turned green instead of being red. And this strawberry is ready to eat. If you let this strawberry go longer, then it will start to turn a dark, dark red. And when it becomes a dark, dark red, it's super sweet. Just it becomes very sweet. But that is ready to eat. Notice how it just kind of came off so easily. Like I almost could have took that top right off too. But that is ready to eat. And um, that is the life of a strawberry plant. But my strawberry plants here, there's a few different types of strawberry plants. So you have June bearing is one variety. And you have uh, 
a plant that will bear all year. And these that we planted will plant all year, or at least all season, and they're called Everbearing. And I'm grateful to have them, that's for sure, because we've harvested tens of pounds of strawberries this year, and we planted these as brand new starts this year, this spring. And they have just grown like crazy. A lot of people say, plug out all the flowers. Don't, don't let any flowers grow. Pluck them all off so the plant will grow bigger and then it'll be better. But well, I, I never did that, and I have tons of strawberries. The plant grew like crazy good, and everything is all great. So that is the life of a strawberry plant. And, um, you know, that's what I want to share with you guys today is strawberries. So I have the strawberry here. I don't add anything to it. Mmm. That is so juicy too. I water my strawberry plants twice a day for about two minutes each. It's on timer. My strawberries get water twice a day, once in the morning, once at night, for about two minutes each. And these are some of the juiciest strawberries I've ever had in my life. And they're way better than the store-bought ones. Those store-bought ones are sick. They like, they taste fuzzy. Like, I just, I just don't like it. But, these are my plants. And I want to share with you guys everything about strawberries. Thanks for watching.